Thank you very much, and good evening to all of you. I'm pleased to be honored this way, and I actually, when I got the notice that I was going to be inducted, it was quite a surprise for me. No one spoke to me about it, didn't ask me to give any input. So things can happen without me being involved, I see that. <laughs> but truly, I'm honored and pleased. And I think of myself as I stand here, coming from the state of Louisiana, it was like going into a strange land, coming to Alaska, because there's no way in the world, no way, had I ever thought I would end up in Alaska. <laughs> Maybe for a visit, but I hadn't had that on my radar screen. But once I came here, I love the country, I love the people, and I feel this way now. This is my home. I was not born here, but it is my home. I hope to die here. You know, I feel like the story in the Bible when they talk about Ruth and Naomi going off into a strange land, but she was willing to be accepted by them and they accepted her. And she felt that they were her people and she was their people. And she carried out their wishes and did a great job. And I feel you are my people. And all of you in this room, many of you, as I look at your faces, you have helped me get where I am, as I have helped you get where you are. We can't do anything by ourselves. We do need support. And I'm standing here on the backs and shoulders of many people. I don't know if my family is in this audience, but I think I have a daughter here <laughs> and a granddaughter. <laughs> And I told him, I said, you could come looking just like you are from work, from school. You don't have to get dressed up. Come on over. I want somebody in my immediate family to be here. So if you're here, stand up. Don't just raise your hand up. I want to see you. As I take my seat, once again, I want to say, Together, we can make a big difference. And I hope that I can continue to make a difference along with you. You know, in the end, what I wanted to be said is that she fought a good fight, and she won that battle. That I've done good work. And every day that I get up, I hope that I could do something that's going to be helpful to somebody. Somebody that can't speak for themselves. Somebody that's not able to express themselves, somebody that just needs someone to say a kind word to, I hope that I will be there for them. And I ask that you continue to hold me in your prayers so that I fight this battle to win, not only for women, but all people in this world, a better life. Thank you. <laughs>